Okay, so I actually want to talk about this. I rarely show my children. If I do, it is for a quick second. They are never the primary focus of my content. If I get a brand deal that they ask for my children to be included, I will typically either pixelate their face so that that way they get blocked or I feature them without featuring them. Like the backs of their heads or their hands grabbing things. And I also compensate them for their time. Like when the brand pays me, I pay them a certain percentage of that fee and their education accounts because it's only fair. I also try to only talk about my experience in being a mother. So I try not to talk about their thing. And of course, like I don't give any personal details about like what they specifically like, like their school, where we live, things like that. Of course, just for safety concerns, but also like they are growing, developing into humans. And there's pieces of them that I don't want to just sell off to the internet. I don't want people to know my children in that way. And I have a big platform and I just, I'm very protective of them. But even sharing stories about this, I really like went back and forth and I even asked my husband, like, what do you think? This is not really my norm. But for me, this was my experience as a mother today where my child did something that was so out of the norm, so not normal for her. I was truly shocked and I was angry and I just needed to be validated. I understand that that was a selfish thing for me. I put my need for being validated that I'm still doing a good job ahead of my child's needs to be completely protected. But I will say that there's a lot of moms in my DMs and my comments saying, thank you for sharing because I'm going through something like this right now with my kid. And sometimes that is this experience of motherhood where we're all kind of quietly struggling, but like nobody's saying anything. And I want my content to be normalizing the struggles of motherhood and not being a perfect Pinterest mom that like sometimes my kids are assholes. I still love them. I'd still do anything for them. And if your kid is being an asshole, it's okay. You're doing a good job. And honestly, it's probably their dad's fault anyways.